What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Yeah, that's pretty weird. And I'm glad I went back to the room to take another double look. Let's find out what you're hiding. Lord have mercy. I bet it's some secret stash that he has. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Now I Crazy. have Nathan's phone so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. I doubt Nathan's gonna come back anytime soon. Um... I'm gonna go and rewind enough. No? Hold on. I'm trying to make sure I cover my steps here, because last thing I need is for Nathan to realize someone got into his room, so... No, still, I guess my rewind powers won't work this time, or I would need to do it after I place the stuff back, I I'm not sure. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Behind the couch. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. <gasps> He's back. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> Damn, he headbutted him? You are so fucking dead! And he had a gun. Get off me, bro! Wow, Warren. No, I'm staying out of it, sorry. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Damn! That's right! Crack his face! Yo, I love this. Aw, oh, pussy ass. Please. Now you want to cry and beg. Please stop. Pussy ass bitch. That's what you get. He's down. Hey, come on. Stop. I'm sorry. Fuck your yes, stories. We have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn, if it wasn't for Warren, bro. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. Scary to you, but not scary to me. Yeah. That shit was nice. It really hurts. Damn, that was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good he to know. deserved to get his ass so where beat, are you bro. Going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better. Um, Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Damn. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was that shit was funny as hell. Watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. 
Will he even answer you? Just say you have the Frank money. Frank always answers when he wants money. Yeah, exactly. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. So many dead whales. I know that area stinks. It has to be, because usually with whales, when they die, all the gases are slowly let out of the body, so... Oh shit, there's Frank. God, I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole's gonna help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Mm. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me... And Rachel. Absolutely. Aww. So let's play this cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Chloe, are you ready for this? Max, are you ready for this? Like, this is gonna be the second time you're gonna be going up against Frank. First time was lucky. Second time... I don't know. Oh, man. I really hope we're able to find Rachel Amber in all of this. I would be so sad if she's, you know, dead. Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. Damn, and yeah, dissing him too? Oh, man. Ooh, what's this? Take the trash out sometime, dude. This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. I mean, how can he really take the trash out when he really is trash? Oh, fresh meat. So Pompadou must be okay. Good doggy. Yes, the doggy is so adorable. Chloe looks ready to rumble. She is. She's ready to be ass. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Hmm. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not okay. like Chloe here. Oh, come on, so leave her alone. what do hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. Because I do. No, no I'm not. I... I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you, you go want church? something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to <gasps> do. Get it, bitch. Yo! Back now! You think you can... 
Yeah, there goes the dog. You fucking killed my dog! Oh my god! Whoa. She just killed Frank. She just killed the dog. But then again, Frank grabbed me by the neck, so... Damn, that's just awkward as hell. Chloe, you murdered someone, bro. Oh no! Chloe... I just shot a man... and his dog. Can we rewind or not? Frank Powers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it was self-defense for both of us. Like you said in the Max, car. Frank is really dead. I know. But we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. And then once we find the code, I'll try and rewind or some shit. I don't know. That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Is it possible to rewind? Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself. Or forget this. And only I can change it. And I will change it. I'm not gonna have Chloe be a criminal, so... Ooh, okay. Um, let's knock. Listen, Chloe. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Please watch your mouth. You have no social skills here, and you will piss off Frank immediately. You kind of love this, don't you? Fine, I'll try being like you for a change. Or how you used to be. Hmm. Alright, this should be good. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now yeah, why yeah. are you losers really here? We need we the names. You, you have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Damn, man. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, uh, your dog is kind of scary. Could you please close the RV door? You aim your gun at me, but you're scared of my dog. Yeah, that yeah, figures. sure. Yep, sure. You're right. Oh, thank God. Because I don't want the dog to get hurt, so... Okay, there, you're safe. Now, what do you want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Help us. Or else. Are you actually threatening me again, little girl? No, no, I'm not. I... Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. Yeah, you yeah, yeah. Everything for free. Yeah, not yeah, yeah, yeah. From me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's I why I'm in church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just Don't talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Shit. Get it? Set the fuck back now! Oh, okay, the leg's better. Gosh. The leg's better. You actually shot me. I wasn't gonna hurt you. 
Oh, this fucking hurts. Oh, it hurts. Chloe, you shot him. I know. You're both fucking crazy. What do you want? The codes. We, we just want the code for your account book. Now. You're fine. Whatever. Just, just put the goddamn gun down. You already shot me, all right? There. Cool. Now leave me alone, all right? Just, just get out of my life. Do you want us to call an ambulance or... No, thanks. You know what? I'll manage somehow without the police. Oh, right. Let's bounce. All right, let's get out. I'd rather have this outcome than Frank dead and then Chloe feeling some type of way, so. Let's go. Shit. This could have gone way worse, but Frank might be more dangerous to Chloe now. Yes, Max, you can change all this if you want. The thing is, though, I feel like if, you know what, fuck it. I'm satisfied with this option. I'd rather have Chloe shot him in the leg than kill him entirely, so. I mean, there is a possible chance he might come after afterwards, but the thing is, he sh she shot him, so. He knows Chloe, what Chloe's capable okay? of at this point. Sorry, he, I, I just keep thinking about shooting Frank in the leg. Well, Please in the don't. last rewind. You saved us. Frank is lucky. Yes. We have to keep moving forward. Mm-hmm. In the last rewind, you killed the dog and Frank, so I better I rather focus have... on this board and start tying these clues together. Yeah, you're right. Let's just focus. Gather info on a character by selecting all the correct clues. For each section, there is a specific number of clues. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Okay, well... Of course, I'm a suspect. <laughs> Proving David sucks as a detective. Sorry. I mean, David has nothing else. Okay, let me see. Um, uh, I say, oh man, hold on, let me look at the others. I hope in this case that David has good tracking skills. Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. And that's at school. At least David was finally going after the right suspect. What the hell's this? David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. Oh, man. Okay. Um... Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? Hmm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. David should have done way more than take photos of Kate. Yeah, well, he was paranoid about the whole thing. Okay, so how would I put this? Um... I don't know what to do. Any? Mini? Uh, Mo. Oh, no. This is not working. I don't even know what to do at this point. Um, how about any? Mini, money mo. Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. So it's not the right thing? Damn, this is gonna be harder than it looks. Um. Maybe one. Two, three. 
Looks like this isn't the right combination. Okay, what about... Let me, let me look at this again. Overheard Kate and Dana talking, talking about supplies for Vortex Cloud Party, drugs, blah, blah, blah. Uh, let me look at the coordinates again. Sorry. Maybe this? Oh, you're treading water, Otter. Try again. Okay, well, I did these, and it led me to this. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Spies are us. Wait, clues? Hold on. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? <sighs> There's a lot of numbers in here. Um, Nathan Prescott continues his family's historical legacy at Blackwell Academy with a stellar academic record and a variety of extracurricular activities, including work with the Acadia Bay Homeless Fund. Nathan is also a popular with students and faculty he stands as a proud representative. Shut up! No, he ain't. This is the Vortex Club party where Nathan drugged Kate. Did he do the same thing to Rachel at another party? I... I don't know, man. Holy shit. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Oh, so busted. It's good to see the Prescotts can't cover up all their tracks. We regret to inform you that Nathan Prescott has disrupted various classes over the past month despite repeated warnings and leniency due to a crude outburst in Mrs. Hola's intro to literature class on Tuesday, September 20th. Nathan was sent back to his dormitory for the day without a proper write-up for his files. Nathan has enormous potential but also erratic behavior patterns that may need supervision beyond Blackwell's ability. The school cannot tolerate these these disruptions, so we hope you will discuss this matter with Nathan to impress upon him the severity of his situation. Please see the attached file for full reports. If there is a dark room, we better find it. It's a good thing Chloe slipped all these files on her flash drive. Rachel in the dark room, okay. Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Okay, that's a phone card. Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. All right, so I need four things. So he here it goes. Ready? One. Uh, two. Three. Four. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. Let's start hacking. Okay. Uh, let's unlock. Um, hold on. I'll do the elevens. Oops. Bad code. Okay, so that ain't shit. What about this paper? Um, ninety-five thirty-five. <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Okay, what about nine nine? Eight, n no, is that three? Damn it, hold on. Oh, Lord. Um, what about, hmm. Nineteen ninety three could be it.
You locked it, dumbass. Whoa, that sucks. Okay, hold on. Let's start hacking. Cool. Um, what about 0058? You locked it, dumbass. What the hell? Ooh, sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to. Um, you know what? Let me just do Frank's clues. I'm curious. Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Sorry. Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. Okay. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but... I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. Dave Madison and right. Nathan Prescott have both come to my office to warn me that Rachel Amber has been a drug mule in Mr. Madison's talk radio terminology, acting as a front for another local dealer. Considering Rachel's ex exemplary status, I told David that I would need more concrete proof, and he promised he had more to show. So, what happened to Rachel after this? She dumped Frank, but I don't think he would hurt her. I read this letter earlier. I remember. Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Hmm. Wait, these are his clients? Even a couple teachers? Fancy car? Huh. Well, one teacher. Nathan. Justin. Katie. Huh. Okay. Maybe Rachel took a road trip with Frank, but she did come back. So weird how close they were. But Frank couldn't keep Rachel. Or protect her. There's no doubt she loved him in some way. Okay. Okay. Um, you ready? Here's what I'm gonna do. One. Two. Yes, the game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Okay, okay. Max, remember these names and see how Nathan fits in with all this. Nathan, okay. And then K-E, Chihuahua. And in all reality, that's all I need to know. Either I am looking for a rat or chihuahua, so. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. Rot. 930. Huh. Hold on. What time was that Max, club again? I know we can snap all these pieces together. Roger that. I'm gonna study the board and try to connect all these dots. Okay, anyways. I already got two. Um, damn, this is gonna be hard. Okay, next one. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. <laughs> that explains a lot. Okay, nothing here. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? Okay. Huh. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. Cool, I can use that one. So select, select. I'm getting a contact high just reading this. 
I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Hmm, I don't want to know. Oh, yes. These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Uh, that's it, Max. Nice. Not bad. See, I got one one clue down. Let's focus I'm on so the other two. Oh, and I'm glad you're willing to work with me as well, hon. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.